Hey guys, Ashley here. Today we're going to be planning inside of my coaching and my social media planner. I am a health and fitness coach and so I have a planner set up just for it. And then I also use this planner as my social media planner. Now, the layout that I'm using is actually from Rochelle. Um, she is known on Instagram as Plans by Rochelle and I got this from her Etsy shop. I will link it down below in the description box. Highly recommend this layout. I absolutely love it. I'm going to be using the detailed floral sticker book for this spread and then I'm also going to use this hexagon punch that I have and I just want to show you guys I ordered this online and I ordered this the medium size it looks super duper tiny online but I promise you it's not so here's a comparison of what the large is totally different sizes so the medium I mean I thought it was super duper small and so you know I initially had gotten a large and the large is it's way too big so the medium is definitely the size that you want for these for the hexagons to go in your planner the large works great but it's just they're kind of too big okay so let's get started with this I'm gonna take three different stickers and as you can see here I'm gonna cut the stickers and then I'm going to punch them with the hexagon thing and I can get three hexagons out of each sticker. Those hexagons come from the sticker book and then now I'm just going to lay these little hexagons that I punched out. I couldn't figure out where to put that one so I put it back. So here in just a second, you're going to see me punch the page and I do this because that clear sticker is right over top of where the punch is at and I've learned that it's so much easier just to punch it instead of trying to cut it out. So what I do is I take any kind of like scrap piece of paper or whatever and I put it behind the spread and then I stick it inside of the punch and I punch it and then the sticky part will actually stick to the scrap piece of paper instead of being stuck to your punch. But if you don't have a punch, you don't need one, you can just cut them out because that's what I've done forever even while I had a punch I still just cut them out but punching them has been a lot easier for me so I'm just adding some more decor to it some florals some stickers up top here to note certain days the top section of this is um, over on the right hand side the blocks up top I use that for when my YouTube videos are gonna go up and when my IGTVs are gonna go up so this layout actually doesn't have Saturday and Sunday because Rochelle created it for her work planner and she didn't need Saturday and Sunday. I need Saturday and Sunday. So I decided over here on the left side, um, I put those two little stickers down to indicate Saturday and Sunday. And this is a Muji pen, which I highly recommend. I finally, finally got one and I absolutely love it. It's in 0.38, wonderful pen. I got it from Amazon. I can link it down below as well. And so I'm just writing in Saturday in the light blue and then I will put Sunday into the darker blue color. And up top there I just wrote get it done as a general to-do list. And now I'm going to take a green mild liner. I'm going to use the chiseled in to make check boxes for Saturday and for Sunday. And then up here, what I'm writing in now is on Monday and on Thursday, I have a team call. So I am a health and fitness coach and we have weekly team calls. Actually, I have two of them a week now. And uh, Monday night and Thursday night, we will hop on a team call. Now for my social media plans, um, I know that this week I have videos coming up on Tuesday and Thursday and then I'll do IGTVs on Wednesday and Friday, but I don't write that in just yet. I only wrote in the team call stuff because I wanted to figure out which videos were going up which day. So that's it guys, that is my social media and coaching planner spread for this week. I hope you enjoyed it. Thank you so much for watching my videos. I cannot express my gratitude for you guys and for your support and for showing up and for watching. If you haven't already, make sure you subscribe, come hang out with me on Instagram, and I'll see you in the next video.